Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you on how you can make text taller in Canva. And there will be three methods that I'm about to show you. And then you can decide which method you think would be the best for your design. So let's start with the easiest method, which is method number one. I have this text and this is actually pretty tall font, but you can change, uh, you can make the, te the text taller by using a different font. Uh, the font that I'm, that I'm, I'm recommending here is Bebas, that's the name of the font. So let me just duplicate this text box and I'm going to show you the comparison. Click font and search for Bebas, that's the name of the font and I'm going to use the Bebas new acrylic. Acrylic, sorry about that. And yeah, that's basically it. Now you can see if you actually match the length of the text compared to the previous font, you'll see that this font in particular is a little bit taller than the font that I was using before. So this is the same length more or less, and you can see it's way taller than the original font. So that's the method number one, which is by using a taller font. And the method number two is different. So let's move on with the method number two. I have the same text and I'm going to make it taller. First, we are going to need a third party app. Let's go to apps, search for Typecraft. This is the app that we are gonna be using. Click on it, click open, and yeah, this is the interface. You can start typing the text that you want to make taller. So it's going to be hello again. The font, you can change the font type, and then you can also change the style if you want to, the colors. And lastly, on mirror points, you want to enable vertical. This will make it easier and faster to make the text taller. So you see that this is the preview and we can change the shape. And now it's time to change the height or how tall this text should be. You can click on one control point right here and then drag it to the top. Let's do the same for the other control point. Uh, you have to make sure it's more or less equal in size and you want to do the same for the one in the middle and yeah. Okay, I think this is good enough. When you're done, you can click add element to design and we got this taller text that's way, way taller. So that was the second method. Let's move on with the third method. And I think that the method is easier uh, compared to the second method because we are not going to be using a third party app at all. So uh, let me show you how. Okay, I have this text. This is the same text as before. And let's go to share, click download. And I'm going to select the file type to be PNG. That's very important. Enable transparent background. And on the pages that you want to download, make sure on the download the page that contains this text. I do recommend to just isolate this text then uh, from other elements in your design. Just make sure it's everything else is empty. Just this text in this page. When you're done, you can click download, and this will download the image version of this text. Okay, that's pretty good. Now I'm going to drag it right here into my document. We got the same content, the same everything. This is exactly the same text, except this one is actually text, no longer. Uh, sorry, this one is actually an image, no longer a text, but they are more or less look the same. So how do you actually make it taller? Well, double click on it like that. And then uh, you want to press and hold the shift key on a keyboard. And then you want to go to the either top left or top right or bottom right or bottom left, it's up to you. And then you, you can uh, you know press and hold the shift key on the keyboard and then click on any of these and you can drag it to the top, just like that. And when you're done, you can click done. And there you go. We have a slightly taller text and we don't even have to use a third party app to achieve it. So I think it's pretty good. Anyway, that's exactly how you can do it. If you find this video to be useful, please consider subscribing to this channel and I will see you on the next video.